You don't have to be a Leonardo or Picasso to feel a tingle in your fingertips when you see a blank piece of paper, but it makes all the difference when you have an enthusiastic teacher helping you to develop your eye and technique. Priya Naika knows what it feels like to be a beginner, and now she's helping her students to let their creativity blossom. While we all may like what we do, not all of us have the privilege of living our passion every day. Priya has found a way, and I'm going to find out how. Hi, Priya. Hi, Kirisha. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Welcome. Come inside. Oh, you have such a beautiful family, thank Priya. You so much. Happily married and mum to three. So, what is it that you do? I'm actually an accountant. The department I work in looks at controls and risks and how it affects finances. Did you always want to do that? Funny enough, I actually grew up wanting to be a teacher. You're a working mom, of course. How do you manage to juggle all of that? It's actually very easy. I have such a good support system. I have a wonderful husband, my mom, my mother-in-law, my sister. They all support me in anything I have to do. I know you've discovered a newfound passion. I recently found painting. I just want to paint and paint and paint so much that the only logical step for me next was to start teaching others. So you finally became the teacher you always wanted to be. I'd love to show you what I do. Hi ladies, Hi. welcome Hi. to the studio. I'd like you to meet Kirusha, she's going to be joining us today. Hi, Hi ladies. Hi. I'm going to go take a seat. This is our piece for today. We're starting with the big brush and remember the wetter the brush, the better the paint takes. And what we'll do is we'll add in some white now so that we show the spaces that are closer. That looks beautiful. Okay, ladies, I'm so happy with your progress. I think that's it for this week. The next time we meet, we will create all the finer details on your canvas. Bye, ladies. Bye. Priya, that was awesome. Would you like to give it a try? Oh, I'd love to. So Priya, where did the name The White Canvas come from? I was at my first paint class. Sitting in front of this blank white canvas left me feeling so vulnerable that when it came to me choosing a name, I thought what better than choosing the first step, the journey. So how do you think I'm doing? It's beautiful. And this for your first time? A Picasso in the making, right? Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for spending time with me today. Thank you for coming and spending the day with me. Priya has definitely taught me that no matter where we are in our lives, we are never too old to find our creativity.